While a refrigerator cools food stored inside, it draws heat away from the food compartment and releases it outside. Let's follow the phases of this process starting in the food compartment. The refrigerant, cold mixture of vapor and liquid, flows into the pipe system in the evaporator. Due to the difference in temperatures, the refrigerant draws heat away from the food compartment. The refrigerant becomes hot and fully evaporates, which draws away more heat. The vapor from the food compartment flows into the compressor, which compresses it and causes the pressure and temperature of the vapor to rise. The resulting hot vapor is conducted into the condenser, where the temperature difference between the vapor and its surroundings causes the vapor to release heat. The vapor flowing through the pipe condenses and becomes liquid. This partly cooled warm liquid then enters the expansion valve. Here it collects, and therefore the pressure in the incoming pipe is high, while the pressure in the outgoing pipe is low. As the liquid flows through the expansion valve, its pressure drops suddenly, and therefore it partly evaporates and cools down. The resulting cold mixture of vapor and liquid is conducted back into the evaporator.